Let's do vectors and vector calculations. We're in the Run Matrix menu. There's a couple of ways you can uh, store vectors. In F3, we've got the Vector Matrix menu. We'll see that we have vectors A and B already stored in our vector menu. Another place is you go Options, Matrix and Vectors. Toggle over a few times and we see the vector commands. In order to store the vectors, what I did was square brackets twice and then one comma two close that now I'll use the vector command and I'm going to store that so we'll store that into vector alpha a I'm going to reuse that same series of commands there instead of retyping them and I'm going to re do the second vector vector b I'll call 2, 5, and then I'll change the name to B. So those are stored in A and B. So I can take vector A plus vector B. Remember, you can't multiply the vectors because these two vectors have different um, dimensions, so you can't multiply those. But if you can scalar multiply, 2 times vector B. some basics.